Welcome back to my channel. Today we are talking about the main riff of uh, straight lines from Vola Band. And we analyze why and how some bars in 3-4 aligns with some bars in 4-4. I want to say a great thank you to Vola Band for sharing with us the creator pack, which contains all the tabs and all the single track of straight lines. It has been used in a huge cover we did as a fan and make my job to, to create this video easier. For the purpose of this video I written the part in 3-4 uh, uh, and as you can notice at the end there is a variation in two quarter. Everything will be clear at the end of this video. Check it out. So the first time I heard this riff I immediately came into my mind that is subdivided into three parts mainly the the main rhythmic cell the first variation and then again the first rhythmic cell and the second variation so it, it's easier to me to understand ri this riff in this way four times the main rhythmic cell one time the variation then five times again the rhythmic cell and then the second variation and the end. Let's count in this way. Maybe I have to cut my beard sometimes. Now it's important to say that uh, the difference between polymeter and polyrhythm. When we're talking about a polyrhythm, we are talking uh, about two phrases or two uh, parts that have the same beat in the same amount of time. It means that four, four notes have the same duration of three over four notes. This is not the case, even if I write the, this riff in 3-4, but it was just for the sake of this video, just to understand the subdivision. We are talking about now uh, of polymeters. It means that the beat is the same, but the phrase last for three four note instead of four so the polymeter enhance the accent and the difference of the accent between one instrument and one another now let's understand why all the beats will be aligned again if you see the above picture is the original tabs and it's written in four four and you can count easily eight bars in four four so remember the snare is always on the third beat of the bar. Below you can find the riff written in 3-4 and you can see as we said before that we have 10 bars in 3 quarter notes plus the last variation which is uh, about 2 quarter notes. In total 32 quarter notes. If we divide 32 by 4 because we have four quarter notes each bar we arrive to say that we have again eight bars in 4-4 so this is the reason why both uh, drums uh, and 4-4 beat 
stay perfectly with the 3-4 of the rib. And uh, if you like this video, please subscribe to my channel.